And when winter is hitting us hard, people across southeastern Wisconsin are there with a helping hand. Mary Jo Ola reports about the good deeds. Since we last met Colin Fultz, Briggs and Stratton gifted him a new snowblower. This latest snowfall is putting him and his new wheels to the test. It helped definitely. Uh, the last two spots I did, I had to pull it out. I just, my back could not handle it no more. Another round of snow means another day. Colin Fultz helps clear driveways and sidewalks in Milwaukee. This time his kids are tagging along and his usual shovel has been upgraded. It's easier, but still hard work. You no, know, it's so deep, so heavy, so it, it definitely helped. But I think the snowblower is where I call it quits, just like me. <laughs> Fultz keeps working, not charging neighbors and only taking money if they can afford it. What's motivating you to, to keep going? Just by helping others, I'm helping myself. You know, it's, it's helping me become a better father, a better son. It's a better uh, just a community, uh, be, uh, just, just my, uh, just, uh, I'm becoming a better member of society. Good deeds spread outside the city limits. Without hesitation, they got out of bed, they showed up. Wilmot Union High School's varsity football team spent their snow day tackling driveways from Trevor and Silver Lake to Twin Lakes, clearing snow in minutes. One of their coaches says they hit 30 houses. A lot of people trying to offer us money or something like that, but um, we're not taking that. It's just community service. But that was awesome. That was a good surprise. We were just talking about how it would be great if somebody came by with a plow, like literally two minutes before they came. The teens and folds show how even in the gray of winter, there is a bright spot. Mary Jaola, today's TMJ4.